Understanding HCG Levels in Early Pregnancy Hello, everyone. Today, we're going to dive into the fascinating world of human chorionic gonadotropin, or HCG, which plays a crucial role in early pregnancy. We'll focus on the typical range of HCG levels during the first week of pregnancy. What is HCG? Before we delve into the numbers, it's essential to understand what HCG is. Human chorionic gonadotropin, HCG, is a hormone that is produced by the cells that form the placenta during pregnancy. HCG can be detected in the blood and urine of a pregnant woman as early as a few days after conception, hence its significance in pregnancy tests. The normal range of HCG levels in the first week. Now, coming to the core of our discussion, what is the normal range of HCG levels during the first week of pregnancy? Firstly, it's important to understand that HCG levels can vary greatly among different women and different pregnancies in the same woman. However, there is a general range that is considered normal. In the first week following conception, the levels of HCG are typically quite low. The levels are usually less than 50 milli international units per milliliter, mu per milliliter. Please note, in the first week of pregnancy, HCG levels can sometimes be too low to be detectable on a pregnancy test, especially those tests conducted at home. Progression of HCG levels As the pregnancy progresses, the HCG levels rise exponentially. By the end of the first week, they may still be quite low. However, these levels typically double approximately every 48 to 72 hours. So, by the end of the second week, they are much higher. Again, it's crucial to remember that these numbers can vary widely from woman to woman and pregnancy to pregnancy. In conclusion, HCG is a significant hormone in early pregnancy, and its levels can give us essential insights into the progression of a pregnancy. However, due to the wide variation in HCG levels, it's always best to consult with a healthcare provider for personalized advice related to pregnancy. Thank you for tuning in, and we hope this information has been helpful. Until next time, take care.